We're at the lawn of the Bailey County Courthouse, and we're right at the front door, and it looks so different, Sherry Henderson, the judge of Bailey County. Yes, it is a beautiful. The results, I think, are just beautiful, and it's made all the detail and the architecture just kind of just uh, show up so much better. Oh, yes. And now, who did the painting? Actually, Joe Garcia has done all the painting, and he'll be painting the building next door also. And Joe, how long did it take you to do this? Uh, about a week and a half. Well, well, that was fast to me. Yeah, it was a lot faster than I, I expected. So. <laughs> and it, it was very affordable. Yes, it was very affordable. The last time we had the courthouse painted was six years ago, and that was. It's always been completely white, and it cost more without doing all the detail. So we're very pleased with Joe's work. And do you know what the O's and the X and the cross in it means? No, ma'am. We've researched that, and we've talked to, uh, uh, well, Gary Hooten, and his great-grandfather, I believe, helped build this building. And he's checked with his mother, and nobody knows what the X's and the O's mean. Do you have an idea of what they might mean, child? I, honestly, I don't. I, mean, I, <laughs> I didn't even know they were up there until we started painting it, so... Well, they really stand out and beautifully do. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You've done an excellent job. Thank you so very much. Now, you had some help. Your parents were here. Yeah. Uh, they like to do this. It's what they do now. And when I started doing this, they kept asking me to come out here. And so I brought them out here. And so now tell me the, your parents' name, Joe Garcia. My dad's name's Raul Garcia. My mom's Delia Garcia. How long have they lived here in Milshi? Oh, I'm going to say early 70s, late 60s, I'm guessing. So they're not newcomers to Muleshoe, and that's good. Now, did you have help from anybody else, Joe? Yes, I had her two different painters to get up on top of the lift, and they finished the top level the first half. And, and who were they? One was Israel, and, got, and the other one was Juan. I'm not sure their last names, but okay. they, <laughs> they were willing to help me out, and I was pleased with how they helped me so now sherry the courthouse was actually built what year of course we can see that right 1925 and i never noticed that being there before <laughs> um, a lot of people didn't <laughs> and you're not the only one but we're really proud of it and so now you're gonna uh paint another building Yes, we're going to paint the probation building. It used to be the old jail, uh -huh. and we're going to paint that so it'll match the courthouse oh, and it'll that blend in. Be nice. uh, now I notice how they spell courthouse with a hyphen. <laughs> yes, they. Well, I think actually that it's not a hyphen. They're just decoration. Oh, um, really? Yes, between uh, before and after the 19, and then between Bailey County and between Courthouse. So it's I it's see. kind of a quig, squiggly. <laughs> a squiggly. So, <laughs> yes, and I have to give the credit because Shonda Black, our treasurer, and Michelle uh, McDaniel, my secretary, came out here on their smoke breaks and thought that there was a lot of detail that was uh, not being shown. So, and then they wanted it black, but I, they compromised and let it go chocolate brown. So, and then Judy uh, Kaufman was a great help with her 19 years of experience at Higginbotham's. Um, she knew the exterior paint, the quality that was better that we had to special order. Uh -huh. So I have to give them a lot of credit. Well, that's <laughs> nice that everybody pitched in. Now, you aren't a newcomer to Milshu either, Joe. No, actually, I grew up here. Uh, I was born in Lubbock and raised here in Milshu. And uh, oh, did you graduate from Milshu High School? Yes, I graduated in 99. And, you know, just looking at this, well, I think, gosh, I want you to paint everything in Millshoe. How can someone get a hold of you, Joe? Uh, just my me. phone number is 806-283-4221. Do it again and do it slow. 806-283-4221. And now, Joe, what year did you graduate from Millshoe High School? 1999. 1999 and of course Sherry is a graduate of Muleshoe High School too and so uh, that makes it extra nice. Yes it does. Yes. It does. And uh, I just couldn't be prouder uh, to see things I never had seen before on this building. I agree. I think we have a beautiful courthouse. We really do and the painting makes it so much more beautiful. Yes it makes it stand out.
When we came here in 1954, what I noticed were the trees that were so beautiful on the courthouse lawn and the squirrels. Where did the squirrels go? I don't know. We don't have any squirrels, but we do have two owls. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. They nest up in our trees. We have a white one and a brown one, and then they also nest at the old uh, flyover to the old Brian Cox building over there. Right. Mm-hmm. I didn't know that. Well, Joe Garcia, congratulations to you. Do you have a company name? Uh, no, I don't. So I'm still working on it. So You used to work where? Uh, previously, I worked with Hugo Vasquez Construction. I worked there for seven years, and then, then from there, I went to the city of Mill Street for five years. Uh, so I think you have found your niche right here in Milshu, and I imagine there will be plenty of work for you once people see this beautiful courthouse. I sure hope so. And it's I know so. <laughs> We've been at the Bailey County Courthouse here in Milshu and talking with Joe Garcia, who just has completed finishing the painting job on the exterior of the courthouse and now he will move to the law enforcement center or to the probation office behind the courthouse and paint it in a similar fashion and I know it'll be just as pretty and also to our Bailey County Judge Sherry Harrison thank you both thank you and I might add Joe would like some help with naming his construction and remodeling business so if the citizens of Bailey County would like to help him come out with a with a snazzy name um, we would welcome that That sounds like a great idea Joe uh, so what should they do call uh, yeah, uh, call me or... They can post it on Facebook also or Trading Post um, and they can go to our Facebook page and just... Now, is it Bailey County Courthouse? Yes, I will have to check with Judy because I just pull it up on my Facebook. I don't have that information right now. But yes, I will get that information and put it out on Trading Post and I'll get that to y'all also. Okay, thank you very much. So if you want to name Joe Garcia's business, well then you... Do they get a prize, a free paint job? I don't know. Oh, it's, I really have to come that. up with something. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, thank you so much to both of you.